<coughs> so those of you who have the MPVI2, um, this is just a short video uh, explaining what you need to do um, before you can pull a file. Or for those of you that do remote tuning through me, pull a file to send it to me. So the first thing is you need to go to the HP Tuners website. And that's weird. And actually, I do believe there's a problem with the Tuners website today. Um, I thought I saw that online earlier, so we'll scrape that. So go to HP Tuners website, and you need to go under downloads, and you need to download MPBI2 drivers, and you need to download the beta version of VCM Editor. <laughs> Once they're downloaded, you need to go to help, and you need to click resync interface, uh, and you need to be online, and it'll sync your interface to HP Tuners. Uh, at that point, if you have any credits deserved to you, they'll come through, uh, and you need to do this every time you buy credits. Uh, when you buy credits, uh, you need to go to the website, go into your account, um, and then you can click on your device, and you can buy credits for your device. Uh, a lot of those who are remote tuning through me, um, <clears throat> some of you guys do buy the credits through me and you don't have to worry about that. Next step is you need to plug your device into your computer and then you need to plug your device into the vehicle, put the vehicle in run, but do not turn it on. At that point you click flash and you click read vehicle. The menu will come up, click gather info. And then you'll get an engine and trans or just one thing. Don't change any settings and then just click read. Once the file is read, you'll be asked to save it. Save it under probably the vehicle year, the person's name, and maybe the engine size. And maybe even the color of the vehicle. At that point, for those who are getting remote tunes through me, you will send the file via email to me, uh, PayPal, whatever. And then we will tune it and send it back. Once your file has been edited and you want to flash it onto a vehicle, you will hit Write Vehicle. Now make sure that you do a Save As and save it as a new file so that way you don't lose your original file. Uh, at that point, you can just plug in your MPVI2 to a vehicle, put it in Run Mode again, and then hit Write as well. So that'll be just a basic video on how to use HP Tuners. Uh, if anybody has any questions, just feel free to let me know.